Hey guys, my name is James and I am going to do a soap expansion science experiment. As you can see, we have three different brands of soap. Dial, Irish Springs, and Dove. So why don't you come follow me? Wait, we will put this in the microwave for about 30 seconds. And we are going to watch it expand. So as you can see, Put it for 30 seconds. Now as you see here, we have one expanded soap bar, well half a soap bar. It's a little bit hard to touch when it comes out the micro, so if I was you, I wouldn't touch it so fast. But I'm going to put it for another 30 seconds, just so we can expand a little bit more. careful when taking the plate out because a little bit of smoke does come out from the microwave. Now as you can see a dial half a dial soap bar just turned into mush, turned into something out of the ordinary. You know you, you wouldn't really expect half a bar of soap to turn into this. So what we're going to do is we're going to place it down on the cutting board carefully and gently. Take this up. It's a little bit hot when you touch it, but try to be a little quick. It's a little bit hard to pull up the plate. As you can see, it's really mushy. It's, it's still hot, so you know, it's going to be mushy. So, as you can see, we're going to put our second one in, which is a dove bar. So, if you like to come over here again, we're going to put this. I say about a minute because this one we did for a minute. Now if you can see here, you see the dial soap bar, you know. You see it's all mushy, it's crunchy, it looks like pops cereal. <laughs> Anyways, now let's watch what the dial soap bar will turn into. As you can see, it spins around and around, and if you look closely, you can see it expanding. You see it melting. Now, just like the same thing with the first one, be careful when taking out the plate. Now, as you can see here, the Dove soap bar, it's partitionally made out of lotion. So, it didn't really turn into a solid, like the dial one. It mostly turned into a liquid, which I believe is due to the cause of the lotion. Now, you want to be a little careful here trying to scrape this off. It's really hot. Ouch. Really burns. 
I want the temperature nowadays, it's freezing cold. Also be careful while taking this off because it does stick to your fingers. I'm going to get a plastic spoon so I don't burn my hands completely. So I got a I got a plastic butter knife. I'm going to scrape this off just a little bit. So as you can see here it looks like well snow. I'm surprised. But like I said, due to the lotion, this made it turn into a liquid, and lotion is very soft. So you can see here we have a little dove snow. Now we're going to get the Irish Spring Bar, we're going to put this into the microwave, and now since we tested the dial and the dove, we're going to see what the Irish Spring will turn into. Will it turn into this? Or this? As you can see here, the dial half bar soap turned into a solid due to its cooling down. When it, when it very first came out of the microwave, it was all mushy, like here. But now, as you can see, as it cools off, it starts to fall off a little bit. It's already, you know, it's already cooled off into a solid, you know. It smells a little bit burned, but you know, it still smells like soap. And as you come over here, our ice springs bar soap just turned. Well, almost like the dove. I'm surprised. Sorry about the brown stuff. I'm pretty sure I burned it. Or it's probably from mixing both soaps. And as you can see, Half of the Irish Spring Soap Bar turned to mush, but as you can see, half of it is still solid. Now what we're going to do is separate this little by little. You know, don't want it to get all mixed up together. Now, like I said, be careful while handling this. Bears have adult supervision so they can assist you while you're doing this. And you can see if you press down on it, it also turns into a little bit of mush. Now I'm surprised to see that two out of the three half bar soaps turned into mush. As for the dial, it just stayed solid. Anyways, that's all guys. Hope you had fun watching this. And as always, hope you enjoyed.